Welcome back, my viewers and subscribers. Guys, the saga at Sajikura Bank continues. A fourth woman has been charged in connection with the multi-million dollar fraud that was discovered last October at Sajikura Bank. She is 26-year-old Tishon Samuels, and she has been charged for larceny as a servant, conspiracy to defraud, and access with intent to commit an offense under the cybercrimes law. She was arrested by members of the fraud squad at the Sajikor head office in New Kingston. It is alleged that Tishon facilitated the processing of unauthorized transactions and the fourth employee to be connected to the theft. Malik McLeod, Trisha Moulton, and her sister Alicia Moulton has all been charged. All four are set to appear in court on February 21st to answer these charges. And guys, the amount stolen keeps going up. Initially, it was said that $65 million was stolen, and now the figure has reached to $69 million. And I believe that the amount will increase and that more persons will be charged in this fraud. And what is so unsettling about this fraud is that the money was paid over to a obia woman. All of these workers are part of a witchcraft coven, and the head asked them to pay money over to her for blessings and promotion on their jobs or whatever benefits they believe that they can get from working obya. I did a video on that, so I am going to link it at the end of this video so you can watch it if you have not done so already. So guys, I will be on this case. So if you have not done so already, hit the subscribe button along with the notification bell. And as soon as I upload a video, you will be notified immediately. Thanks for watching. Peace out. Bye.